us when he can, okay? So today we're going to do A2 flyers and we're going to do part four reading, okay? Yes. Okay, so we have to read and then you have to choose the best answer. Oh, let me just move us down, hang on. Okay. Here. Okay, let's read there and then I will uh, circle the answers for you. Okay, you can start. Yes. An octopus with sleep in the sea. It's half a rouse test with two eyes. People often think that octopus have endless As best days. Okay, so it says here, people often think that octopuses have eight legs, but they, but they actually have four pairs of arms. But they actually, okay. Octopus live in oceans or around the world. Octopus that live in warm water are small. Good. And so, and Is, is that with in cold water uh, must... Octopuses live in oceans or around, around the world. Octopuses that live in warm water are small and... And is that life in cold water? I can't hear you, sweetie. And... Uh, uh, number three. What's number three? Each? Each. No, it's not each, my love. Octopuses that live in warm water are small and... And, and those, I call, your, your voice isn't very clear, so I'm just guessing what you're saying. Those, yes? Those. Okay. Those in live that live in cold water. Live in cold water. Are much. Hi, Sock. Have a teacher. Okay, let's just say, let's have Sai answer this one. That live in cold water are much. Are much biggest. Big. Not our much biggest. It's our much bigger. Bigger. Most computers are most octopuses. Octopuses are. Nocturnal. Nocturnal. This means that they sleep all day. 
all day. Good. And moves around and eats a snack. After buses, just release me. For once or twice, yeah. I want to see if Sock is balanced. Okay. Octopuses usually live? For once or twice, yeah. To move octopuses, just lay just the ends to work. You can use their arms along, to walk. To walk along the bottoms of the sea. When they need to, they can swim as 40 kilometers an hour for a short time. If an octopus to hide from, from, from other creatures, it can change color. This cause also when, when they sorry it's... when they need to, they can swim at forty kilometers an hour for a short time. If an October needs. Hide if an ultimate um, needs to hide, okay. If this intense colors to hide from other creatures, from other creatures, yes, good. This intense color is can also get into very small space. Because his body is very soft. Octopuses are very clever. For example, they can they can learn new things and open portals. Octopuses can see very well with the lens and but they can't hear anything. Good. I can't hear anything. Okay, let's save it there. Okay, now next one will be reading and answering questions, okay? Okay, so let's have you, if Sock comes along, then he can also read, but while we wait for him, I want you to read this piece first, okay? So you can read that piece, and if he comes, he can continue reading for us, okay? Yes. Okay. It was... So, it was Sophia's birthday last week. Her grandfather gave her tickets for a pop concert. The concert was in a stadium. Sophia went with her mother. Mom drove them to the stadium in her car. While, while they were driving there, they saw a man in the road. He was at them. Mother stopped her car. Do you need any help? She asked. Yes, please, says the man. I got a problem with my car. Engine. Engines. Can you give me a lift to the stadium? I'm left for work. Of course. Says mom. Okay, let's have a look if Sock can read for us. Sock, are you here? Sock, can you hear us? Yes. Okay, Sock, we have started. We're already 10 minutes into the lesson, okay? Let's, yes. I can't see you. Can you put your camera on? I can't, I don't have camera. But I just saw you now earlier. 
I can't do the lesson with you if you can't put your camera on. I need to see I you. I keep another. I keep another. I keep another phone. So you can't put your camera on. Yes. Um. Okay, let's have Sock read this piece for me here. During the sunny, sunny mom turn on the radio, she and the man tap Sophia Jordan. She was listening to music and thinking about the band. She was very exciting about seeing them them on the stage. Excited about seeing them on the stage. Excited. Okay, re read the next paragraph. When they arrived, When they arrived at the stadium, the man said, Come with me, Sophia. I got a surprise for you. Sophia and Mom follow him. He took them. Behind the stage, Sophia saw the singing. Saw so the singer. Saw the singer and the, another member. No, and the and other the, members. And the other members of the band. Sophia talked to the band members for a few minutes, and Mom took lots of photos of them. When it was time for the circle to start, a woman took Sophia and mom to sit in the best seats at the front. Friend. After the concert, Sophia said, what, what an amazing, amazing day. What an amazing day. Okay. Okay, let's, I'll read the example for you. The example says, Sophia got tickets to see a pop concert for her birthday. The tickets were a present from Sophia's grandfather. Okay, Thai, let's do number one. Let's read number one's question. Sophia. Sophia and her mother went to the stadium by, by mom car. Mom drove them in her car, yes. Sophia and her mother went to the stadium by car. Okay, by car. Number two, Thai. Mom stop, stop. Good. Wait, Sock, it's Thai now. You weren't here for the first part. So I'm going to let her do number one to number four, okay? Yes. Okay, Thai, mom stopped because? Mom stopped because a man needs help. A man needed help. Number three. During the drive to the stadium, Sokka talks about about the band. Wizo, Wizo, Mom, and the man chatters. During the drive, Sophia thought about? Talked about the band. The man? The band. Oh, the band. 
Sophia thought about the band while mom was driving. Okay. Number four, Sophia felt. Sophia felt. About seeing the band she was. She was very excited. She felt excited. She felt very excited. Yes. Okay, so he can do number five. At the stadium, the man took Sophia and mom. Mm. Follow him. Say again at the stadium, the man. The man took Sophia and mom to follow him. At the stadium. The man took Sophia and mom. No, not follow him. Mm. The stadium. The man took Sophia and mom. So he took them be behind the stick. Yes. Sophia and mom. At the stadium, the man took Sophia and mom behind the stage where they met the band. Number six. Mom. Mom. Mom took a lot of. Mm. What did mom do? Mom took lots of photos of them. Mom took photos of Sophia. Sophia and mom watched the concert from, from, from the Messi. Okay, Sophia and mom watched the concert from Be Bessie. the front, which were very near the stage. Mm. Okay, from the front. Okay, so, so um, I'm going to let it go this time because I can hear you concentrating, but next time I can't have you in the class if your camera is not working, okay? So you must try and sort out your camera for me, okay? But I don't, I don't have. You don't have a camera? Yes. But why did I see you earlier then? Why did I see you earlier? Did you, did you have a, did you have a phone with a camera? You must try and get a camera, okay? Yes. Okay. All right, let's have a look at number six. Sorry, I just want to see what seven is. And then we're going to write the story. Okay. okay, sorry, no, not that. Let me just make it one page. Um, here, single page. Okay, let's have Thai. You can do number one, two, and three, and Sok will do four and five. We okay. are camping in the mountains today. The weather is horrible. 
but I don't mind. Okay, Sock, if you can think of an answer, then you must tell us, okay? Yeah. Today the weather is horrible, but I don't mind. It's warm in our tent. Tonight the weather is horrible, but I don't mind my sack. What do you think the answer is? That. No, it's not that. Because I don't mind because it's warm in our tent. Today the weather is horrible, but I don't mind because it's warm in our tent. Okay, can you read number two, Thai, every evening? Every evening, my brother and I yes work for a while. Then we, then we, five. Then we, then we play a, a play a board game. A board game while. Moms and dads cook dinner. There are a lot of there are a lot of animals here, like butterflies and be beetles. Okay, butterflies and beetles aren't animals. What do we call them? Suck. What do we call butterflies and beetles? They're not animals. What are they? They are insects. Okay, insects. There are lots of insects here, like butterflies and beetles. Okay, um, Sock, you can read. I think they're really interesting. But mom doesn't let like them. Tomorrow, we're going to go rock climbing in the mountain. Um, I mean, never climb before. I? Mom? I I have never I have never never climbed before. Mom says it's very beautiful at the top. So I'm a I'm a so I'm a tech frog. I'm a heaven forgotten. <laughs> no, sweetie. Not I must haven't forgotten. I must forget to take my camera. I must. I must have mm -mm. Not. I must not forget to take my camera. I mustn't. I must not forget to take my camera. Okay, number seven. Look at the three pictures. Write about the story. Write 20 or more words. Okay, now we're going to make a story. Now, first, we're going to have Sock tell me a story, and then we're going to have Thai tell me a story, and then we will type it, okay? Okay, Sock, tell me a story. The boy see the boy sees some camel and he thought it is a monster. And then there's three camels and two and two pe and two push and people there. They are smile and waving. The boy is Smile too. Finally, the boy can try the camel, and he and the, he 
is happy. Okay, what about you, Thai? Can you tell us a story? Yesterday, yesterday a boy goes to the desert. Some commas come to the boy, and the boy thought that that's the monster. And then there are two people with three commas came and was being and smashed with him. He, he smashed too. Finally, he finally see he derives the comma and he is very happy. Okay, so let's type it. Let's say first. There was a boy in the desert. He saw, he saw something coming over the hill. He thought it was a monster. He was very afraid. Then he saw that it was two men with it was two men with three camels. They were friendly. The boy felt happy. Finally, the men offered the boy a ride. The boy took a ride on the camel and felt happy or you can say re uh, relieved let's take this one out here we don't have to say happy again okay so can you read the story for us yeah first there was a boy in the desert he saw something coming over the hill he thought it was a monster he was very afraid. Then he saw that it was two men with three camels. They were friendly. Finally, the man offered, offered. The, boy a offered uh, the boy a ride. The boy took a ride on the table and felt happy. Sure, are you tired? No. <laughs> you sound tired. Okay, I need you to say it to me off your from from your mind, okay? Off by heart. Um, I want you to read it one more time, then Thao is gonna read it twice, and then I'm gonna take the words away and you can tell me the story again, okay? Okay, can you read it, Sok? Yes. First the ball was a ball. There was a boy in the desert. He saw something co coming over the hill. He thought it was a monster. He was very afraid. Then he saw that it was two men with three camels. They were very friendly. Finally, the man of the great uh, boy offered. Arrived. The man offered. The man offers the boy a ride. A ride. The boy took a ride on the camel and felt very happy. Okay, Thai, can you read it for us? First, there was a boy in the desert. 
he saw something coming over the hills. He thought it was a monster. He was very afraid. Then he saw that it was two men with two camels. They were friendly. Finally, the man opened the box of rice. The boys took a rice on the camels and felt happy. Good. Can you say it one more time? Read it one more time. First, there was a boy in the desert. This, he saw something coming over the hills. He thought it was a monster. He was very afraid. Then he saw that it was two men with three camels. They were friendly. Finally, the men of over the boys arrived. The boys took a rise on the camel and felt happy. Okay. Sark, now I want you to tell me the story. First, the boy, there was a boy in the desert. He sees something is coming on the hill. Over? Thought, over the hill? Over the hill. He thought it was a, a, a monster. A monster. Mm -hmm. And then there's two men and three camels. They were very friendly. Finally, the man of the of the he, um, offered he, the boy offered the boy rice, and the boy said happy. Good. Okay, Thai, can you try? The boys first. The boy was in the desert. He saw something coming over the hills. He thought it was a monster. He was afraid. Then he saw he saw two men with three camels. They are friendly. Finally, the boys, the men, of course, the boys ride the camel. He to ride the camels. He felt happy. Good. Very good. Well done. Okay, now we're going to go and do some speaking. We can go down to speaking test one. Okay, we're not going to do find the difference. We will do this one and the story. Okay. Information exchange. Okay. Okay, so now you have to concentrate really well, okay? You have to listen and concentrate. So, blue is for sock. Sock, this is your card. You concentrate on your card, sock. Only look on your card, okay? Then the red will be thigh. Thigh, this is your card. You only look on your card, okay? You don't look at Sock's card, okay? Yeah. Are you are you ready, Sock? Yeah. I can't hear you. Yeah. Okay. So uh, Sock is going to ask questions. Um to thigh, okay? And then we're gonna swap around. Okay, Sock, you ask her questions first. What's the zone? 
I can't hear you. You sound very far away. Come closer. Yo, what does your teacher at class name? My teacher. What? Sorry, class. sorry, that's the wrong way. What is your? Oh no. What is John's? Art teacher's name. What? No, not class name. What is John's art teacher's name? Okay, Thai. John's teacher as class name. No, is no. Hang on. John's art teacher's as name. Oh man. Name is. Yes. You don't say class. Okay. Good. Next question. Sock. How many students are there in John class? How many students are there in John's art class? Okay, Thai. John's class class have There ten. are 10 students in John's class. Yes. When when is John a class learn? When is John's art class? John's art class on is on Saturday. Good. Mm. What is John art class like painting? What does John's art class like painting? John? Like painting people. Like painting people. Good. I can't hear you, Sock. Is John a good artist? Sai, John is? John is very good. A very good artist. Okay. Okay, let's ask her again, Sok. What is John at class name? No, ask her again. What is John at no, that's not what it says. You're not concentrating. It's not saying art class's name. Read carefully. What? Sock? What is John at teacher name? Teacher's name. John's name. John's as teacher's name is Miss Bird. How many students are there in John's art class? There are 10 students in John's art class. Um, when is John's art class? John's art 
last class is on Saturday. What the zone at lab live painting? Zone at class live painting pupil. Okay, now we're going to stop here and we're going to change roles, okay? Okay, so 